We recognize Vitor's athletic excellence on the IndyCar circuit and his talent, and are honored to have him compete on our world stage. So it's my pleasure, on behalf of Ironman, to offer Vitor Mira one of our coveted slots to this year's 2010 Foster Grant Ironman World Championship 70.3. This was actually on my bucket list. <laughs> it really was. You swim uh, 1.2 miles, you bike 56, and uh, you run 13.1 uh, on the 70.3 Ironman. It helps on racing. That's the first thing. When I feel stronger on the race car and not feeling tired whatsoever after the race, it's a big, big thing for me. But also, when you cross that finish line after whatever time you do, it's so good. It's a lot of, you suffer a lot. I suffered a lot, the ones I did, but just crossing the finish line just makes it worthwhile. It is a great accomplishment. And that's the, I think, the soul of, uh, of Ironman or any other long distance race. You have to push yourself to the limit and you have to compete with yourself for all race long. And I think that's the, that's the beauty of it. That's what I like about it. It's a competition with yourself. And uh, a lot of people, uh, sometimes thinking to themselves before training and before anything, think that uh, I'm never going to be able to accomplish this. And they start doing it, start training it, and all of a sudden they cross the finish line and it's, it's a big, it's a big feeling, it's a big, I mean, it, it, people get, uh, many guys just, even after uh, finishing uh, not as well as the winners, but they, they, they come in tears and this and that, so, it's a it's a big uh, it's a big accomplishment. 